Okay, tubers, family and friends, we're back home now from the buyer. And Leo loved riding in the truck as always. So we're gonna go into the store, the Queen store, and see the money that we got, which was which was a lot nicer than what we thought. Yeah. It come out to be what twenty three thousand plus. Yes. Okay. So now Lilybeth is going to work the numbers and divide for yeah. everyone in the crew. Help me to, div to divide it into my workers yeah. and us. So Do before you know? on the video I said it was going to be 50-50 but it's not really because, because uh, the two senior guys of the crew, the foreman which is Ruel mm -hmm. and then Burling, those two guys, they're the ones that cut the coconut, right? So they, they're the ones that pick the right coconut to cut so that the right coconut are falling to the ground, the mature pieces, right? So they get extra. They get uh, 2000 each. So that 2000 each comes right off the top of the total amount. And then the rest of it gets split 50-50 between the crew and uh, the owners. So that's how it works here. So just let you guys know kind of kind of the division of the money and how that is divided. So in case you guys were wondering about that. So like I say, you know, it's anywhere from 18 actually it was closer to 25,000 this time, which I'm surprised, which is which is good because the price was a little higher. Last time it was 26 pesos per kilo and now this time it's 2850 per kilo. So that's real good. So hopefully next time it'll be can go higher, but we'll see. But beautiful day here today. It was great for the for the coconut crew doing their harvesting. And uh, now we'll just have a little bit of a celebration meal for the harvest. And thank God for what he provided to us. And that's about it for today. I'll let you guys go. And just uh, giving you some clues of what we do here with, with our coconut harvest. So, love you guys. Take care and God bless. Bye-bye.